Hi, it's your Wednesday broadcast. I'm Whitney. I'm Lexi. In honor of National Women's Month, here's a quote. There is no limit to what we women can accomplish. Michelle Obama. I am craving a blizzard from Dairy Queen right now. Well, DIY Foods is going to teach us how to make one. Hi, Titans. I'm Richard, and this week I'll be showing you how to make a Dairy Queen blizzard. First thing you want to do is take your mixing bowl and the cup of your choice and put them both in the freezer for about 10 minutes so they can get really cold. Now after 10 minutes, what you want to do is take your bowl and put that in your stand-up mixer with the paddle attachment, put six cubes of ice cream of your choice into the bowl, and wait for it to mix so it's about the consistency of soft serve ice cream. Once you've mixed your ice cream, you want to turn it off, put the toppings of your choice into the bowl, bigger toppings you can break apart before you put into the bowl, and have that mix on about low. After you've mixed in the toppings, you want to take the cup out of the freezer, and then take the ice cream that you just mixed and put that into your cup. And now you have a Dairy Queen blizzard. Good luck on final signs. Now back to the anchors. Thanks, Richard. Well, let's go see what info they have at ASB Cribs this week with Jake. What's up, Titans? I'm Colin Book with ASB Cribs, and this is the final segment of the trimester. And with that being said, here's Jake Murray with the ASB News for the next couple of weeks. What's up Titans, Jake Murray here with another weekly President's Report. First up, just continuing this month, we'll be going through some of our Women's Month uh, informational podcasts and posts, so stay updated for that. Um, and then moving forward, we'll also have some information coming out about Most Spirited Titan. There's been some informational meetings, and if you're participating in that as a senior, uh, just reach out to ASB if you have any questions. Uh, probably the most important thing we have on today's agenda is talking a little bit about our reopening guidelines. Um, so for those of you that didn't know, uh, the PUSD board actually put in for a waiver for, like to go through the state process uh, to make sure that Poway could reopen even during the purple tier times. Um, sadly, it, the state shot it down, but um, we can actually still reopen once we're back in the red tier, which we're really close to. So. We're still looking to reopen probably in the next two weeks um, time period. So look forward to that, Titans. That's all I have for this week, but I'll see you on the next one. All right. Thank you, Jake. Now back to the anchors. Thanks, Jake. For the last week of the trimester, talented and working Titans decided to interview one of the program directors, Natiel Jackson. Let's go see what her job does and what she does at it. I'm Riley Gibson. I'm Trevor Harbour. And this is Talented and Working Titans. My name is Natil Jackson and I am a junior at Poway High School. I am a barista at Manzanita Roasting Company. My favorite part about the job are my coworkers. They're all fun and amazing people and incredible to work with. Working in a coffee shop is really fun. It's high energy. I love working with customers and with people. So that's something that I really enjoy about it. I also love making the drinks. It's really fun and it's exciting to see myself get better over time with steaming milk or pouring latte art. While on the job, I do everything from register, taking people's orders, making the drinks, making food, cleaning, closing, organizing stuff, everything really. We have two locations, one at the Bernardo Winery and one in Escondido. Bye. Thanks, Natil. Let's go see what last bit of tea they have at Rumor Has It. Hey Poway, this week on Rumor Has It, the Bachelor finale for the 2021 season will be aired on March 15, 2021. And next, Hannah Burner is now engaged to comedian Des Bishop after dating for less than a year. Now on to Patricia. Thanks, Jelena. This week has been big for Marvel fans out there. With the last episode of WandaVision airing on Disney Plus and the supposed title of the third Spider-Man, movie being released. I say supposed title because three of the stars posted pictures on Instagram with all different names. This caused the Marvel Universe community to speculate if Marvel was finally going to introduce past Spider-Mans like Tobey Maguire and Andrew Garfield into this universe. I guess we'll have to wait and see until December. Well that's it for this trimester times. This is Rumor Has It, now back to the anchors. 
I can't believe what happened at the end of the WandaVision episode. Well, it was Agatha all along. Well, Polly, this is the last Wednesday broadcast of the trimester. We hope you enjoyed, and good luck on finals. I'm Whitney. I'm Lexi. Bye. Bye.